Hey, what's up YouTube and welcome back to the long dark. Last time we crafted our first bow and completed our first hunt. We bagged ourselves a deer and technically we bagged ourselves a wolf too. Today, we're going to try to find the dog and uh, try to get ourselves a wolf pelt. So I hope you enjoy the episode. If you do, please drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. And with the intro out of the way, let's get started. All right, if I remember where we left things off, we have a bunch of meat sitting outside. We're going to bring that in and we need to start harvesting it. We're dealing with a bit of a blizzard. Yeah. And uh, we're not going to want to be out here in the cold. Uh, these, we'll probably leave these for now. Uh, I will take this one and we'll leave that one. Yeah. Let's go inside. And um, we don't really have to go far, but we are going to start harvesting these meat bags. 10 pounds and we're going to go ahead and harvest that. It takes about 25 minutes and 100 calories per bag. So I wonder if we should have left them outside while we do this. We could do the full bag later. Uh, let's see what the condition loss is. Eh, not, not, not bad. So we'll just keep doing that. Let's knock out another one. All right, I harvested everything. We got 15 steaks out of that. Um, each is about two pounds. Uh, that's actually a pretty good uh, haul, I think. We are going to go ahead and just drop everything down here. Let's get them all outside. And I'm going to turn this off. Uh, it definitely got dark inside while we were doing that. Uh, and we are going to step out real quick, even though it is cold. And we're going to go grab some... Uh, some wood. The storm obviously cleared up. And I'm hoping that some sticks dropped. And we're able to kind of do a quick wood haul. We're probably going to cook into the night. And then tomorrow we'll kind of see what the daylight has for us. I do still want to go try to find that dog. And uh, get our arrow back. And maybe get the hide that he has on him. And any wolf meat. I'm not really going to eat the wolf meat for now. I don't want to deal with the parasites. Uh, an interloper, you need to take antibiotics and or birch, not birch tea, and or reishi, I think it is, uh, for like 20 days. It's not something I want to contend with if I don't have to. Um, so we're going to try to avoid eating predator meat. Uh, you know, predator meat being wolves and bears until... Unless we absolutely have to, which we shouldn't for a little bit of time with all the deer meat that we just got. There was nothing on that end of the railroad track, so I figured I would come down this way and kind of see what we could find. Um, I know I've pretty much kind of been pulling the sticks out of this area uh, over the last couple of days. So I'm figuring there's probably going to be some down here and maybe some around this uh, area over here. Last time I was over in this little... Um, cove, I guess, for lack of a better term, uh, was before we went to go smelt. So we kind of stopped in there, grabbed some sticks, and then hit up the deer carcasses along the way. And, uh, so it's had some time to respawn the sticks in that little spot, so I'm hoping there'll be some fuel. We'll grab these, though, for now. Uh, grab this one and this one. I could spend the time and break those limbs down. And if I was a bit warmer, I probably would. But for the way we are right now, um, even though it's a clear day, it's cold. We're losing a lot of condition uh, over the last day or so. I'd really just like to get a fire going. Uh, kind of for like our last fire. I'd like to get a, a good cook off. Uh, restock on some water. Uh, stock up on the food. And not plan to really start a fire for a while after that. We can get um, the camp office kind of set up. And then, I mean, we'll obviously start a fire 
you know, and uh, I think eventually we're going to go to Coastal Highway. But, you know, we'll start a fire on the way there or, or if we're out, but I'm not really planning. I'd like to not have to start a bunch more fires inside camp office um, once we can kind of get established. Uh, let's grab these up here. Yeah, that's kind of all, all we got, right? How many sticks do we get out of that? 17. Not a ton. Seven minutes. Uh, thing is, I don't really want to tank the condition for three sticks on seven minutes. Uh... Well, let's let's try it. Let's just see what it, how how bad it is. Yeah, that's quite a dip for three sticks. I'm good. Let's get back. We'll head back to the camp office. We've got decent amount of sticks. Worst case scenario, we leave some of the meat outside. Uh, it can be frozen, and uh, it can remain frozen. I should say, um, outside even if it's raw. And then when we cook it, it replenishes it back up to 50%. So we don't have to do a full cook-off. I kind of wanted to. I probably shouldn't, uh, honestly. Um, now that I'm thinking about it. I just kind of wanted to have it ready. Especially because I think we're getting closer to, to cooking five. I will have to um, double check once we get inside. If it wasn't so cold, this would be a great night to be out. It is, like, bright. The moon is bright. We're, uh, we can see it's high visibility. It's just the cold that sucks. If I had some teas, we'd be better off. But I don't. Uh, let's go ahead and um, light this lantern so we can see what the heck we're doing. And uh, I could break these down too. No, don't do that. We can break these down upstairs. And that's probably going to be where I start the fire. Uh, don't know if I need this. I'll come back down and get it if I need to. Uh, let's get upstairs. I want to drink just a little bit. I need to... Oh, let's eat too. Got close. Um, yeah, we're not, we're not happy being this tired. But what can we do? We might actually even just call it a night, go to bed, and uh, maybe just do this in the morning. There's no sense in um, ta tanking any more condition than we have to. I'll just keep this on me for now. And uh, let's eat. I should be able to eat enough of these cattails to sleep through the night. And um, I should have enough water, I think, to get us through the night as well. So let's get uh, stocked up and uh, check in on the morning. All right, it's the next morning here. We're going to start this fire. Uh, that was the wrong move. I wanted to use the book. I picked up the tactical th gunsmithing off the ground and then used the stick to light this fire. If it doesn't work, we'll uh, we'll go ahead and try with the book. Otherwise, I'm going to drop it. Perfect. Let's put this out. Probably end up scrapping that too. Fire starting three. That's good. Um, let's go ahead and cook a gallon of water. And I want to top this up with some sticks. We got a couple, um... We have a, uh, couple coal there, too. We can use them if we need to. Uh, I got a gr couple... I grabbed those waters earlier. Let's go downstairs and grab a couple of these steaks. And, um... I'll probably eat the last of the... What was this? Deer, also? Yeah. I'll probably eat this now. 480... Should have probably brought it inside. Uh, I'll grab a couple of these. Uh, maybe four. Alright, we'll throw the venison on the stove. We've got that there. We've got the water going. We've got 44 minutes. Probably going to need to use a lot of these sticks today. Uh, we can uh, break down some furniture around the house too. Get an hour and a half first. It's going to be seven minutes. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, what can we do in the meantime? I think we can look to make prepared roasts, 
prepared reishis. We can do one of those without that meat burning. All right, perfect. Yeah, let's take that. Let's go ahead and cook another one. We'll get that water going. Uh, we can drop these sticks, uh, these um, steaks down too. And we just, yeah, here's a. All right, those are dropped. Let's drop this book too. I don't need it. Uh, can we, do we have enough time? How long has this got? 31 minutes, all right, and 12 minutes there. We've got an hour there. Can I spend some time and sew up our clothing? Because I know that's getting tattered, right? 72, yeah, this is 38. This will take 30 minutes, so we can do this. Probably better things I could be doing with my time. 26 minutes still boiled and 58 minutes still burned. Okay, we're in, okay. There you go. And we'll cook this other steak. And we got 33 minutes there. Go ahead and add a little bit more fuel to that fire. Uh, I'm going to eat this. I don't need to be full on food. But I do think that we do want to... Not be trying to dance with... Uh, losing well fed or you know while we're trying to build it back but restarting the timer i guess right um it's not something i really want to deal with uh let's check our clothes again so this is 78 percent now yeah these need to get repaired that's 94 that's pretty good 70 53 yeah all my stuff is is pretty pretty banged up uh that's something to work on in the uh in the interim here Go ahead and grab another stick and we'll grab this other venison. We'll cook that. And then I probably will uh I will probably make those teas before we um I'll probably make some teas while we're uh using this fire. Two pounds. So yeah, we can eat this these little ones. I wanna stick these cooked ones outside. Uh, that's 30 minutes till ready. Probably cook another one. Drop those off. Uh, we will take this and we're going to make the tea. Mm, yeah, we'll do that. Cool. I need to restock this water for sure. We want to get that stocked back up. I'll probably take that with me. Move that there. We can move that there. And then let's take a second here while these are going. Uh, let's look at the skills. So our skills are here. We're almost level three for uh, carcass harvesting. So that, that'll be nice. We're not quite close to level five. Uh, this might cooking here might get us closer, but we're not quite there. We got a little ways to go. And fire starting, we just got level three. So now we no longer need tinder, which is awesome. We definitely don't have to carry that around anymore. Uh, that's preferable, right? We'll cook that too. And then while that is going, we're gonna prepare the next batch of mushrooms, 15 minutes. So we will do that now. All right, the mushrooms were we prepared those, and we're going to pull this. We will cook this off. And let's check the fire. 35 minutes. We're going to add a few more sticks. And add those. Get that up to an hour. That's good, and that's good. Let's go ahead and prepare another tea. Yeah, the mushrooms. We got 12, so we've got quite a bit we can make. Um, let's take it. Let's cook another batch of water. Actually, I think I have the water for purification tablets too. So that's 48 minutes. Um, I do think I have those water purification tablets. Let's, let's look. I got one. Was there another um, 
box of them here. I don't think there was. I'm trying to think. Let me check downstairs. Alright, I checked. There was no other tablets in uh, the camp office here. Maybe I left them at Trapper's, or I might have even used them. Uh, it's hard to say, but we're going to need to boil this entire thing of water, so we're going to want to be paying attention to those. We've got the tea here. we got nine minutes there. Is there anything quickly we can do? Yeah, we could do another rose hip. And we'll grab this venison. And we'll go ahead and cook that tea. And then we'll make the mushroom. And then I will check the fire after this. 27 minutes, we're good. 45 till burned. Let's go ahead and cook another mushroom. And we can drop, I think, the two teas we made. Now place those down. And don't forget to move them. Uh, we got six minutes there. And 42 minutes left there, but we don't have 42 on the fire. So let us go add those. Yeah, I'll do 56 minutes, because I do need to get some... Uh, I'm going to need to pull some torches. Let's see here. I'll probably leave these for now. We got plenty of teas here. Uh, I'm going to instead spend my time pulling the torches. Or not pulling the torches. Breaking down the torches we have. Yeah, let's harvest that. Two minutes. I'm going to harvest a few of these. And uh, just keep this fire going for what we need it for. All right, the last of the torches here. I basically, I shredded all of them, even though they're good ones. Uh, they were only at like 15 and 17%. So I, we might as well re, we roll, uh, we might as well re-roll them uh, as we're pulling stuff out of here. Uh, we will take that water and that's five minutes until boiled. Let's go ahead and take this torch and I'm gonna pull these and put them out. Oh, you bastard. Uh, we will just toss it. Alright, this one's good enough. And we'll take... Oh, I was like, wait, did I leave that water there? Okay, yeah, these are fine. Um, let's see. Five? Five's probably a good amount. I usually like five or six. Pull that one too. All right, and we will move this over here, and this too, and we'll break those down another time. Now, what to do now? So we got less than a gallon of water. Uh, we're okay on food at the moment. Got a couple steaks on me. I would like to go out, though I over the tees I can't hear if there's a blizzard. It does sound like there might be. Yeah, the wind ain't sound very good out. Uh, how are these? These are all curing. That one's almost done. Those are done. These are almost done. Yep, those are cured. These are all cured. Yeah, this is looking good. Uh, let's go outside for a second. See how the weather is. Terrible. Okay. Uh, we might as well stick these out here, right? I really don't want to be out here in this weather. But very quickly, let's just look and see if any new sticks generated. Yeah, there's a, one up here. I don't want to be out here for very long, but if we're going to be out here, we're let's just grab the sticks, right? All right let's go back in. So there's a couple things we could do. 
Uh, I think for one, we could finish this other arrow, which we need to do for sure. Uh, a couple other things that we could do. We need to fix our clothing. And... Like, what is this going to take to repair? I don't even know. Um, hmm, just trying to think here for a second. So I think we could either make this arrow or we could start working on our clothing. I kind of want to get the arrow just done. So I think we're going to knock that out. And then see how the weather holds up. Cool, so we got another arrow. That's the last one we need. Oh, there's another torch here. Uh, put this over here for now. It does sound like the weather might have let up. Let's drop these. I don't need to carry them. And let's drop that too. Put it on our wall. Oh, I let all those get cold. That's not really helpful. All right, let's grab these teas. The weather just ended, so let's go out, kind of see what we're working with. Uh, I'd like to resupply on sticks if we can. I'd also like to see if we can find that wolf. Hopefully it's warm. Uh, not, it's not the warmest of days. I'm not going to start another fire for us to get to heat up the tea, I don't think. I mean, I guess I could. Probably should, right? Uh, I just want to see if I can see any quick sticks over here. Yeah, it's not looking promising. Alright. I think I see one. Mm, nope, that's just a shadow. Okay. Uh, let's head back to camp office. Uh, I want to plan a little bit better about what I want to do before we start aimlessly wandering I'm assuming I heard ptarmigans I'm assuming that the wolf that we killed went down that way somewhere so he's gonna be somewhere out on the lake we could sleep in the buildings if we wanted to um, I'm not quite sure I didn't want to do it I don't really want to use the matches if I want to get start conserving them a little bit better uh, if we can plan to but I need these teas uh, if we're gonna be going out and uh, I'd rather not push it and have ourselves get killed uh, it just doesn't make sense I didn't come this far to <laughs> go die because I don't want to I want to be all conservative now uh, the matches are no good to me if we're dead. So, let's heat up these teas. And, um, and then I'll pull another torch or two, uh, to drink. Go ahead, drink it, you idiot. Um, I'll pull another torch or two, so that way we can, uh, not waste that fuel. But I got a whole nother three boxes here, so we're, we're good. And we got a mag lens. Um, we can use out in the in the field if we need to. Um, so, should be okay. I'm going to put these uh, arrowheads away. And these feathers. We don't need them. I'll leave the leather too. I'll probably put these away. I'm not going to be mapping anytime soon. Uh, I will drop this off as well. And I think that's fine. Uh, I think we have the lantern on us still. Yeah, let's leave this too. Right there. Okay, and how are these doing? Let's drink this one. That was the one we already started to drink. I will pick these up. And, oh, there's nothing left. Leave it. All right. Uh, I have a skillet, right, if I need to? Let's check in here. Yeah, I got a skillet if I need it. And I'm going to eat. take that and eat that. Oh, come on. I just warmed up these teas for a blizzard. Wonderful. I do hear the ptarmigans. I mean, we don't have to waste the day. I could just hunt the bird. Uh, 
Let's see. If I see him, I might hunt him. Otherwise, maybe let's just make a quick journey up to the forest lookout. Because I haven't been there yet on this run. And we're kind of sitting here idle anyways. I don't know what could be up there, but there might be a candy bar or two. Another cooking pot or something. Might be worth just checking out since we're sitting out here with warm tea anyways. And there's usually a bird or two up there. So we can maybe grab those too. Uh, we just cleaned out over there. And this actually isn't the worst blizzard. It's not a whiteout at least. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Um, I don't want to be out too much in this uh, weather. There's also a chance that the wolf that we shot last episode uh, could have been deleted. Which would kind of stink, but I mean, it's just the luck of the draw, right? We'll grab these sticks, though, while we're over here. Try to stock up on all the fuel we can while we're out this way. And uh, I might drink another tea. I'll drink another reishi. Yeah, it's helping stave off the cold a little bit. We could make the acorn coffee. If I want to spend the time getting the grounds. Is the acorn coffee worth it? I feel like I've asked that in a previous episode. I don't know if I got an answer or if I did get an answer. I don't remember. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, if you use the acorn coffee a lot, do you not use it a lot? I think you need the heavy hammer to make it. Uh, you're supposed to crush them up. Which is kind of why I never bother. But we have the heavy hammer, so I could bother. Let me know. For now, I'm going to try to make our way up to the lookout without snapping my ankle. Yeah, today's not the nicest of days, man. Like, this wind is just whipping. We're losing our cold. Uh, we're, we're dropping a tent. There's hypothermia right there as I'm bringing it up. Uh, I mean, it's visible, but it's cold. When we're, while we're up here, uh, well, actually, we're not going to be any warmer, but maybe I'll start a fire. But while we're up here, we might as well grab all, like, the cloth we can. Maybe break down the wood inside the, uh, lookout and bring it back with us. Is this a scrub brush? No. Okay. Usually there's some birds up here, but I'm not hearing them. So maybe with this wind, they're not, uh, they're not around. Yeah, I don't see them anywhere. Oh, there's, uh, I think there's some cattails down there. We can grab them, if there are. Uh, some stones doesn't help me. There's probably a fire log in here. I say fire log, but there's probably like a fur limb. Maybe a cedar limb. Not like uh, one of like the fire starting logs. All right, we're up here. Let's go. Let's see what we got. Anything of use. Oh, it is warm. That's good. I'll take the bandage. Bar of soap can stay. Uh, looks like there is a skillet to the side here. I'll take it with us. Or should I leave it? How many skillets we need? Just leave it. If I ever venture up here for whatever reason, um, it's here, right? Like if I ever need to come back up here, we know, like we don't have to lug one. We can just lug one with us, you know, and, and there's already one up here or whatever. Not that I'm ever going to remember. But, at least, I just, I don't know. I don't feel like lugging it back, to be honest. <laughs> so, um, do I want to break this down for 20 minutes? Uh, 81 cal, yeah. Let's just do it. 
we were just talking about how we need firewood. It's uh, it's doable. What's this take? For four, 39 minutes. 29 minutes for three. I mean, do I want to invest the calories in it? What's our weight like? We got 10 pounds to work with. Yeah, I mean, it's not doing me any good up here. Uh, I think we just do, maybe we break down the chair. And do I want to sleep for an hour? Yeah, let's do it. Just, I'd rather warm up. It's going to be cold on the way back anyways. But it lets us last longer. And it's probably the warmest part of the day now. Uh, oh, yeah. That's so annoying. <laughs> All right. Let's head back. Uh, any? Yeah, let's grab a. Probably worth it, right? Grab a couple screen grabs. Get ourselves a thumbnail or two with this uh, lighting. I don't like that one. All right, let's go down. And maybe we'll see a ptarmigan on the way. I don't like the ominous music. That's not needed. Uh, are there actually cattails down here? I don't remember. I don't think we're hurting for food enough to check. Yeah, there's nothing down there. Um, we're at, we're pretty okay on food at the moment. The music is kicking up like we might get an aurora tonight. So, that would be interesting. I already think I checked the computer at the camp office, so there's no real benefit of an aurora for us. Where's this? Uh, I think that is I'm trying to recognize where that is. Yeah, we're cold. Uh, let's head back. I'm going to head down the hill. I'm going to try to collect any sticks along the way. Try not to break my ankles. Hopefully we get back to the camp office without any problems. I'm going to take a bit of the long way. Try to get uh, any sticks I can find over here. I'm not seeing any wildlife either, which is good. Uh, there's a rabbit. That's fine. He'll live today. Not going to bother. Uh, is that some stones? It is. But I really need sticks. Like the stones, eh, they're not helping me any. Give me this stuff. No, that's a limb too. Uh, is that a deer carcass I wasn't aware of? It looks like it might be. Oh, it's... Uh, wait, hold on. Is that? I think it is. I'm going to grab this quick and check. What is this? Oh, it's this, this light brown made me think this could be like a deer. But it's not. It is part of the wood. So, forget that. Uh, that's a wolf. It's kind of beelining it right to me, so let's go. Get out of here. He's moving so quick. Okay, he's good. I don't think I smell at all. Just be careful coming around here. Just don't want there to be any other wolves. Grab this quick. And we see my right. You can stay there, stone. Any more sticks come down? No. Nothing else to respond. Very good. Let's head back to camp office. Kind of see where things are from there. Now I'm going to have to do another cook. Not today, at least. But I only have, like, another two steaks, I think. And it looks like I'm going through at least two to three steaks a day on a 
on a journey. So something we'll have to keep in mind. But if I could get another ptarmigan or something in the morning, then uh, we could make another broth. The broth is going to be very helpful. Uh, I need to get over here and grab this storm lantern. In case I need to see. And we are warm. Now, let's uh, drop these sticks off. See what our haul was today. Okay, 16's not many. But the 5 reclaimed is pretty decent. And I'm gonna just drop for now. We'll probably just get rid of them, but I'm gonna drop all these tinder just to get them out of our inventory. And has this one been red? No. How, how about this one? Have I read either of these? No. Uh, we're gonna try to put this with the other books. Yeah, we'll drop that off too. And let's see here. There's not much I could do in the dark. I either gotta start a fire to work or we're gonna have to call it an early night here and then try to make it to the morning where we can kind of pick things up. Mm, the sun's just creeping up and we'll top off our water again. And we should actually have enough light here I think to repair. Let's repair these socks. Yeah, perfect. Yeah, let's get some repairing done. Uh, that's going to help us stay a lot warmer. Like this, this jacket's not doing almost anything for us. We need more cloth, though. I need at least one. There was some cloth around here. Sure, I'll find some. What was that? Cloth? Yep. See ya. Uh, we'll break it down by hand. No reason to dull the knife. And we'll grab these two. Now, how long will it take us to fix our jacket? 45 minutes. Let's do it. Cool. All right, and we just leveled up mending. So, or we didn't level up mending, but we have added to it. Oh yeah, we got a little ways to go. Okay. Um, do we start a fire? Probably. I'm gonna need more water. Uh, let's do that. Let's start a fire and then let's go out and look for that deer. I know I said deer. I meant wolf. We gotta go find that wolf. Let's add some fuel here. Put those in, and let's grab a couple of reclaim too. That's good. Let's get a water going. And I'm gonna grab another uh, thing of meat. And throw that on the grill. Alright, we're gonna add that steak on. And we'll drop the others. I end up picking up those sticks again. We got an hour 17 on there, and we are going to keep sewing, I think. Uh, 43 minutes, or 43 here, but 30 minutes. We should be good to go with that. There's 30 minutes there and 30 minutes there, and an hour there. I would like to get my jeans fixed, so we will do that. Another question for anybody who might know. Take that, and... Now that needs to go the other seven. Um, another question for anybody who might know, but the sewing kit that I'm using, uh, where is it? Is at 30%. Does my success rate dip? Like if this is a 5% sewing kit, is my success rate going to dip versus using the 100? Or is it like just use it till it's gone? Pass the time here. And let's take that, 
because we're going to use the other water purification tablet. That'll purify as much as it can, and then we'll put the rest back in the pot to boil off. And cook. Oh, butter. Yeah, let's do the rest of it. Cook that. 24 minutes. And let's drop these teas. Shit. I tried to speed it up, and I went to pull that venison off the stove and tried to speed up the cooking it at a minute left. And it must have just clicked over right as I was hitting the space bar, and I ate it. <laughs> <laughs> it's a bunch of crap, man. It's a bunch of crap. Uh, we got 15 minutes there. I like this torch. We'll take that. And let's grab one more. Alright. Uh, I guess we'll carry it with us instead of lighting it up. can always put it out outside if I need to. Uh, but let's go see if we can find this wolf. I don't know if we will have time because this episode's already getting a little bit long. Um, or it's getting, we're getting out close to time. But I don't know if we will harvest him and bring him back like I had planned. But we might be able to find him. And then if we can find him, maybe we'll crash at a building nearby and uh, we'll save it for the next episode. We'll kind of see. I'm kind of doing things a little bit different in this episode uh, in terms of pacing. So there actually might be more time than I'm uh, anticipating. And if that's the case, then we will absolutely uh, finish up what we intended in this one. I don't want to keep these this torch going. Like, I don't know if I'm going to chain it. Uh, but we are going to... Just kind of see what we're working with here. Maybe I should chain it just because I know there tends to be wolves over here on the lake. And I don't want to keep wasting matches. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. I'm trying to think where he would run from because he did take off across the ice. Oh, is that him? Or is that actually a rock? It does look like a rock. All right, we're going to drop this. Let's grab another one. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to pull it out and drop that one. But it didn't. Uh, let's see. These are rocks. They are not... Uh, Wolf carcasses. Oh, not good. Why is the wind have to pick up now? Alright, well. There goes this. Man, the blizzards just pick up, dude. Put this away. Uh, I'm not going to hang out around here too long. Oh, he's right there, coming right for me. I'm just trying to see if I can finish my reconnaissance while I'm out this way. Uh, before I call it quits. The freaking weather today, man. There's still, there's still more deer back here. Too. Like, you're still here. I could do another hunt. And we're hypothermic. Might as well grab these sticks. And I wonder if we should just spend the night down here. I don't have a lot of food, though. I'm so tempted to just shoot this deer. I'm so tempted. <laughs> uh, there's a ton of sticks back here, though. We could, uh... Resupply on wood. And, uh, and the weather might break still. You know, like, even though the wind's picking up, there's also that possibility that it breaks. You know, an hour nap and 
Next thing you know, there's no storm at all. So, I'll kind of consider that too. Um, let's see. There's the deer. Tempted to go in. I'm pretty sure we got everything out of here outside of the books. Like, there was no gear. Yeah, we even grabbed all the books. Uh, what if we took an hour? Let's see what the weather does. It doesn't seem worse. Ten minutes for one? Nah. Let's go back out. It's about the same. Alright, let's head this way. Just want to keep my eyes peeled because there were a bunch of wolves over there. They're probably still over there. But if we could find this carcass, assuming it's not been deleted, uh, that would be good. I'd be happy with that. I'd call that a win. First, let's grab these sticks. I bet you my teas are cold too. The only downside with these cabins is there's no place to light a fire. And obviously with the wind like this, I can't... Um, I'm not able to light a fire outside. To warm up the teas or to, to cook any meat that we find. Man, would I like to find... That wolf carcass. I really want to check, like, the opposite side of this, um, this, uh, rock here. Let's go inside again. We'll probably nap again. And, uh, let's check how many sticks we've found. 18. We're getting up there on weight. I'll leave the books. And we'll take another little hour siesta. And it sounds like the wind died down. Cool. Nice. Uh, now. Just be ready. In case I come out here and there's a wolf. Check everything. Okay, cool. The weather did die down. Dennis is here, and I never searched him. And I never will search him again. Uh, we'll grab these feathers since I'm here. We're gonna need to keep making arrows and replacing the ones that were damaging till we get much better at shooting. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna go skirt this dock that's suspicious that right there that little body but when I was looking I don't remember where their wolves were I think they were right here um, I thought I saw I think this it was this rock here that loaded in yeah I think that was it okay um, there's probably some cattails there I could snag I don't see any uh, wolves so let's uh let's just double check. A couple more cattails wouldn't hurt us. Uh, I'm not seeing any. All right, very good. There's uh two more deer over there now. Now I want to check this uh this over here. This might be the wolf. If it is, I think we might actually set out to to quarter him at least. Yeah, this is him. I say we do it. Let's uh start the fire. Do I have the hacksaw on me? I bet you I don't. I bet you I don't. Uh nope. Means we gotta thaw him out. Give me my arrow. 
Uh, let's just start the fire. Let me, what am I doing? Sure wish I had that book now. If I had the book, it would be like 100% start rate. I don't particularly care about the wolf meat. But then again, like having it's not going to hurt either. Put an hour. Okay, and let's uh, drop these teas. That's what we want. So this fire's going. These teas are going. Just drink. Let's just get this and let's drink it because we want to get warm. Okay. Now, while we're sitting here, we might as well get <clears throat> some water going. We're sitting here anyways. Move this, move this, move this. Okay. Now, for you, 6.9. I do not care. Is this moldy, too? Like, that doesn't look appetizing at all. You want an hour and 26 minutes to do this versus an hour. And 250 calories. Yeah, I do not see why I would do all this time. Even if I lose the meat, I don't care about the meat. So I think what we do, I'm going to add some more fuel here. I'll watch the snow. I want to just step away for a second and see if there's any more fuel I can grab. Yeah, let's grab these sticks quick. Because I need to stay warm, so I might need to add a little bit more fuel. So that way we can stay warm while doing this. Without, like, demolishing all of our teas. This is where having a couple pieces of coal on me at all times is going to be more beneficial. That's something I just learned today. <laughs> I know coal makes us warmer. Uh, especially out here. But like 20 degrees heat output. That's okay. Um, it's something. Take this. I could care less if this boils off, honestly. I will just... Just take it, I guess. How long is this going to take us if we quarter him? One hour. Okay, yeah, let's add another stick. Yep, and then let's take the rose hip just to be on the safe side. We should be fine to quarter him. And let's do it. One hour, quarter. Oh, it's still frozen. Okay. Well, how much more do you got? 8%? Okay. Well, we got to wait it out. So fine. We could do that. I guess we could just finish cooking this water, right? Alright, I finished off the water. Let's add another two sticks or so to this. Fine, we're warm. This carcass is almost done. And it's no longer frozen. Let's quarter him. Take all this stuff. Pick that up. And we're going to take this with us. And put it out. And add one more stick. And just grab that torch too. And we're going to basically beeline it straight home. I love it. I love when a mission comes together. I love when we set out for a goal and things play out the way we wanted. And while we're here, can we search this real quick? I'm cutting it close with these uh, with the wind, but we're already over here. Pretty sure this is the last last spot to be in. Let's get going. Just basically gonna run it straight back. And if there's a wolf, 
we'll scare him off with our magical torch. As I'm getting closer to camp office here, I'm having flashbacks of leaving Broken Railroad in the last series. And uh, my torch blowing out and then a wolf coming from around the, the vehicle. I'm like, <laughs> the wolf coming from around this freaking uh, office here. It would scare the crap out of me. Uh, but we did it. We've accomplished what we set out to. Uh, I can't. Let's how many meat bags do we get? We can drop this wolf pout, pelt. We can drop these. Where is our meat bag? Here we go. We got a couple. There's not much to work with here. I don't even care really that much about it. But I think that's going to do it for me today. If you enjoyed the episode, please drop a like. It helps me out very, very much. If you're interested in more Long Dark content, please consider subscribing. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye, guys.